Hello there, everyone. Right now on On It, it's 2.07 p.m. on Sunday, April 26, 2020. Now for today's announcements. The new art gallery at the museum is open as of today. It's a wonderful gallery with space for painting, sculptures, and more. The museum's intrabid curator, Blathers, accepts art donations all day, every day. But if you'd like to make a donation, please be mindful that there is fake artwork circulating out there. As always, use your best judgment. And of course, we'll be holding a special ceremony to celebrate the happy news. If you're interested in participating and have the time, please check in with Tom Nook at Resident Services. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island. Finally, the island renovations are complete. And let's go check it out and let's also hold a ceremony for it. Oh, yeah, my phone's ringing because it's the Nooklings calling me. Yep, they're uh, nice. Awesome. So anyway, with that being said, um, let's check our mail. And let's... Oh, I still have a rank S. Yeah, I'm really surprised by that. I feel like you can easily get a rank S. Cool. We have a lot of things to do today. Let me see what they sent me. Sewing machine. And then this is the song. And Cypress Plant. Cool. Let me grab a few things from my house since we can use them for the museum. And yeah. Yeah, I've grabbed a bunch of fossils and uh, the Ponchu goldfish? Aranchu goldfish? Oh, hey, Jack's on this cover. Nice. This is a more creepy uh, song, I can tell. Alright. Um, yes. Let's also check and see if Red Ship is back there. I don't think that it is, but don't quote me on that. I don't know if he shows up each and every single day or if he just shows up once in a while. No, it is. Cool. Because there's smoke coming down from it. Like, coming down at the beach. It is kind of weird that he has a ship and not the tent anymore. So he, the thing about the ship's kind of sketchy looking. I should board without. I should, is he on the island? I thought we could just go up into his ship and then that'd be it. We're allowed to do that. I think he's still somewhere on the island though. So let's go look for him. Um, keep our eyes out peeled for. Keep our eyes peeled for fossils to dig up and other types of bugs and fishes to catch. Mostly bugs, though. So, yeah. Oh, and yes, let's grab that. 10,000? Nice. Oh my gosh, dude. These investments are phenomenal. The, uh,. Money trees are, and of course, talk to our neighbors. Well, hello there, darling. What's the latest? It's yet another splendid day on on it. Oh, I know I sound unusually chipper, but who can I? Who could blame me, darling? We need to get one more neighbor here. That's really what we need. All right, so Red was over here. Well, Red was actually up there the last time. Maybe he's come down here. That'd be really weird if he went to go see Tom Nook because those two do not like each other. In Japanese mythology, I don't think I ever explained this, but in Japanese mythology, the raccoons and the foxes have always been at war with each other. So that's why Tom Nook and Red have some history. Well, hello, hello there, Pyfel. Let's talk. To add a little zing to my day, I have some mint ice cream waiting for me at home as a special reward. Uh, it depends what kind of mint ice cream, like, like where it's from, to see if it's good or not. Because yeah, some sometimes mint ice cream's really good. So, 
Huh. Okay, so it looks like we have a brand new rock right next to Hornsby's house. Which, that's not bad. It's actually a pretty good spot. No, that's not what I wanted. And yay, just resources. I'll take them. Yeah, I didn't really do a good job of standing right in between the, the holes there. Alright, so with materials from this rock. I really want to know where Red's at. That's actually kind of bothering me. Like, where where is he at? Why is he not at, on his ship? That's just strange to me. It's like, dude, go back to where your ship's at. Like, I don't think we need to constantly keep meeting off your ship. It's okay, I'll, I will come to your ship. Don't come to me, I'll come to you. Hey, what's up, Snuffle? Rocking the day long? Chat with me. This weather rocks. Feels like anything I do is gonna turn out awesome, Snuffle. It is, it is really nice today in the game. It's like beautiful outside. Ah, uh, excellent. Stove top espresso maker. Cool. Ah, Avery, hello, hello. This is the construction consultations counter. Let's hold a ceremony for the museum. Oh, you want to take part in a ceremony, Avery? Right now, we can hold a ceremony to celebrate the completion of the museum remodel. What to take part? I sure am. Splendid. Let's get started. Now then, I'd like to begin our special ceremony celebrating the grand opening of our fancy new museum. It blathers his wings don't even touch together when he claps. Thank you. As I'm sure you've all noticed, Anna has gone through marvelous, wondrous changes. It's all thanks to the fine residents of this island who work together daily. Yes, yes, you have my thanks. I'd like to ask Blathers to say a few words as the representative from our newly remodeled museum. Blathers, if you would, just, um... A word or two? Excuse me. Hoots, indeed. I shall keep this brief. Ahem. Dearest residents of Onnit, it is an honor and a pleasure to take this moment to thank you for your continued support of the museum. Your diligent efforts have turned this museum into the grand, nay, the magnificent attraction it is today. So many fish, so many fossils, so many insects. I love that. Indeed, all who set foot, hoof, or Paul in this museum have you to thank for the splendors they behold. And we now have opened a new edition, one I have dreamt of since I was but an owlet. Yes, a proper art gallery, one in which we shall display proper art, painting statues, proper art. By Jovi, my culture and cur curatorial dreams have come true. Hoots hoots and hooray. I beg your pardon, my enthusiasm has me running at the beak once again. To the point, then, as we celebrate this new wing of the museum, I feel I must entreat you. Please continue to donate your acquisitions. I ask this not just for the betterments of the museum, but as but for the betterments of us all. Who and thank you. Josh, that was that was quite a speech. Er, yes, I mean, no, thank you, Blathers, for those many, many, many words of wisdom. Next, a few words from someone whose valuable contributions made this remodel possible. Of course, I mean Avery, our resident representative. Hmm? Avery? Anything to add? Can I just add, like, a whole wall of text like Blathers did? Uh, woo! Yes, yes indeed. Thank you for your heartfelt and encouraging sentiments there, Avery. Everyone, please get ready to join me in bringing the ceremony to a close. Also, let's wish and take a Kamara photo. So press the camera button. Yes, well then. Hope our continued growth and to celebrate on this beautiful museum. Hooray! Alright. Alright, beautiful. Beautiful photos. Thank you all. This concludes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. The museum does look really nice. The remodel does. So, cool. So now that's out of the way, before we even go into the museum, I want to I want to find all the fossils that we can for today. And I want to find Red, or get access to Red's ship so I can uh, donate a painting 
or tried to donate a painting, that's going to be another fun thing too. We got to look up the different types of paintings and see if they match. So. Yeah. All right, nothing over here, which I also need to work on terraforming on this small part of the uh, island here. Honestly, I might add the park here. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm debating where to add the park at, because I was thinking about adding it to the left side of the island. I kind of don't want to, so I, I don't know. I have no idea. I need to find nice open area, and that seems like the best part. Hey, how's it going, Redunculus? Let's chat. Clear sky, smooth sailing, living the dream, Avery. Good, good, excellent. Bangle. Staying trendy, Grof? Let's talk. I'm practicing striking a pose. It's an important life skill. Never know when you might need to pose. Alright, cool. Uh, message in the bottle, too. We haven't seen Goldiver for a while. I wonder how he's doing. Alright, here's a secret. And the secret did it. And I secreted it. A weird DIY TV show I watched at 2am told me to make this, so I did. Here's a recipe. It's real easy. My head was stuck in my shirt. I said to the DIY, you should try making it too. Captain Al T. Crafter. Pretty tulip wraith. Uh, no. That's not exciting. I'm not trying to sound mean, but that's just not exciting. There he is! I know that shining face anywhere. How you been, Avery? You made the right choice buying that art for me earlier. I've had a lot of folks asking about it. Ah, you know, I really gotta be honest. I think I'm falling for on it. I mean, you've got quite a setup going here and a lot of art fans. So on it once art and I got art to sell, might be something to this. But I can't sell to just anybody. I need someone I can trust completely as if they were family. And since we're basically cousins and because I know you've got an eye for quality, I want it to be you. We'll look at a few things. I've got both art and furniture, plus you'd get my cousin's discount, you in? I'm in! I knew I could count on you, cousin. This is absolutely the right choice. I got my boat anchored off the northern shore, and I'm almost done fixing all the leaks. Long story. Come have a look at what I'm selling. You won't regret it. Okay, cool. Now we have access to red ship. Excellent. Um... Yeah. Cool. Let's check up here for some fossils. Oh, and talk, talk to Nan, too. How's your day going, kid? I came by for a chat. They say you shouldn't start your day without a plan, but they also say plans are a fool's errand. So, yeah, you decide. What is this right here? Oh, lost item. Excellent. I picked up a lost item. I should probably try to reunite it with its owner. What? Investigate. Someone, someone lost this. Ah, excellent, great. Thanks for that. My detective skills are amazing in this game, I should say. Yeah, I need to be building, I need a house over here too. I need to move probably uh, Agnes over here. Then, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna bury 10,000 bells. I wonder if we do bury that. I, I doubt that that much will, you know, grow and pop up. I doubt it. Yeah, since we did get a whole bunch of fossils yesterday, I don't think there's gonna be any today, to be honest, so. All right, let's head over to Crazy, or Jolly Red, excuse me, to ship. The ship looks so small, but I believe the inside is actually quite spacious. Just looking at some of the video footage and images. Okay, maybe not. Ah, Avery, I'm so glad you made it. So here's the pitch. Ready? At Jolly Red's treasure trawler, 
we sell only the finest, and there's nothing finer than fine art and rare furniture, am I right? Of course I can't let all these fine things just walk out the door, I gotta limit you to one piece of art per day. It's a hassle, I know, but I hope the cousin's discount will make up for it. Plus, I'll let you buy all the furniture you want, no questions asked. So take a look around, we've got masterpieces for- Masterpieces by the Great Masters, plus stuff for your master bedroom. Let me know if you have any questions. Okay, so... Cool. I won't lie, an awful lot of folks have been asking me about buying that wild painting left half there. So here's the thing with these. I'm gonna look up these paintings and what they're called. Of course, Google and walkthroughs are a thing because I don't really want to buy something that costs a whole lot of bells and, uh, you know, I waste all those bells and it's not the real one. And just by looking at this, I can already tell this is not the real one. So maybe the price scared them off, so I'll set it for you for 4000 you and I want a closer look. No, this is not the real one. The real one, um, the body is white. Not this bluish smurf looking color. Yeah, it's um No, it's not the real one. Here. Kinda on a website gamewith.net I'm checking out these uh, paintings let me pull up the one that let me pull it up really quick sorry what is it the painting from wild painting left half yeah the real one the uh, the body is white the fake one like I said before it's this one right here the smurf Green color of it. It's because it's supposed to be a human being. This makes this individual look like a monster. Well, I don't think it's supposed to be a human being. I take it back because since the ears on on it is more like an elf, it just this this is not this this is the fake one. I admire the detail. Can't blame you. It's extremely detailed, brilliant stuff. And the best part, all that, that detail can be yours for just four thousand nine hundred. 4,980 bells. I don't know. I understand, I understand. It's a lot to take in all at once. No rush. Okay, let's check out this one. Wow, you really know your art. You can just feel the aura on that proper painting. Huh. I mean, you couldn't buy that kind of aura. Well, you could and should. Let me help you out here. What was it called? With my cousin's discount, you can have it normally for the exact same. I think all these pain, paintings are the exact same price. It's proper painting. Uh, I want a closer look really quick here. All right, let me zoom in on that. And I also want to make sure that... Um, I want to check the other painting too. Because, yeah, just in case... I'm looking at this and this is not, this is a fake. It looks real though, however. This looks like the real deal. Granted, always when you're checking on guides, make sure you have a backup. Or, uh, yeah, make sure you have a backup on to make sure that different types of uh, guides or whatever, they're up to date. And sometimes, like this one, the proper painting, there's no fake art for it. It's always genuine. Really quick, though. Let's check out the last painting right down here. J the Jolly painting. Honestly, I just wish someone would buy it so I can get more work done. I really shouldn't, but I'm gonna add the on a discount on the top of the cousin's discount. Okay, can I have that for the proper painting since that's the real one? That bring, okay, it's the exact same price. I was like, ha, wait a minute, you're gonna give another discount. I want it for the proper painting. Which one was this one called? The Jolly painting? 
Is that what this was called? Because, yeah, like I said before, make sure you, you have a source, and then make sure you have other sources. In this case, the source that you're using isn't 100% up to par. And I want a closer look. Okay, cool. Uh, pretty sure this is called the Jolly Painting. I don't know what's so... Yeah. Yeah, this one's a fake because in the real one, there's a flower in the lower right corner. This one, there isn't. So... Yeah, so the uh, proper painting up there... That's the real one. Yep. Can't get that one out of your mind? I know just what that's like, but I say, why get it out of your mind at all? My offer's still good, you know. For only 4,980 bells, this magnificent proper painting is yours. You got a deal. Ha! Huh. You are not gonna regret this. I'll just take those bells from you. Yep, it's all there. Congratulations, you are now the proud owner of a proper painting. It's been a pleasure doing business with you, cousin. I'll get your art packed up and shipped out tomorrow. That's the only thing that sucks about Red is that he... You immediately can't buy buy it. You have to wait till tomorrow. It's really hard to resist the mystic statue, isn't it? The store policy is one art purchase per custom per day. You can look all you want, though. I'll take a look. I don't... Am I... Yeah, I don't. Am I am I crazy that I can't? Do I donate statues? I don't remember in the past that I did. The charm and elegance of the very finest cream soda wrapped up in a floral lamp. Much as I want to charge you a full price, I had a real tasty pair earlier. So how about two thousand one hundred bells? So yeah, I think we do buy statues. Yes, that's the right choice. I'll just get those bells ready for from you. I need a lamp for my house. And what we got here? Bed. Cute bed. Uh, no. I'm good. I think so. Alright, well, that's it. Cool. Thanks, Red. You won't regret it. Yeah, so that's the only thing about Red that you have to look out for is the fake forgery artwork. It sucks, honestly. So, anyway. I believe we got some Nook Miles from that too, by the way, so let's... Let's claim these from earlier. Pretty sure that we did, somewhere. True patron of the arts. Collecting artwork con contributes to the cultural quality of Onnit and Nook Inc. We'll give miles to folks who prove themselves discerning connoisseurs. Awesome. All right, cool. Let's head over to the museum then and donate what we got. And yeah, honestly, I don't know about you guys, but that just might be it. This is kind of going over the new museum renovations. There's really nothing else to add. Since, yeah, nothing really else going on. Um, the new museum does look really nice, though. I really, really like the way it looks. It is a beautiful looking museum. A lot better than, than what we had before. Alright, Blathers, get up. Who? Who? Oh dear, pardon me. Who, who, if it isn't Avery. I am pleased to say that the art exhibit is finally finished. Your very own donations made it all possible, Avery. So, to you, I am most grateful. The entrance to the gallery is but a jump up the stairs. Please do take a gander at your leisure. It's behind that curtain. We'll check it out after we... Uh, assess fossils and make a donation. Alrighty here. Cool, more than one I see. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Yes, indeed. Quite splendid. Us, our museum already has fossils of these. Seriously, there's no fossil out of all that that you need. We all have those fossils. Really? All right, well then let's uh, sour around to goldfish. This was annoying, by the way, to capture. Who, who, who? This is undoubtedly a ron a ronchu goldfish. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your ronchu goldfish? Yes, please tell me. Wonderful. I would love nothing more. 
The brown shoe goldfish is a charming relative of the goldfish with a bumpy head and stout, round body. They have ordinary heads when born, but develop impressive rectangular heads after about three years. Supposedly, their head shape changes depending on factors like the size of their tank. So round shoe goldfish enthusiasts aim to raise perfectly shaped specimens and work hard to achieve this. Of course, no one asks the rancho goldfish themselves what shape they want their heads to be. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Just assure it all donations are displayed in a timely manner. You have my gratitude. Alright, excellent. Thank you, Blathers. Nope, I am... Okay. Let's go check out the art exhibit. I love how it, like, has its own... Like, up this staircase. Okay, so... Yeah, of course it's not gonna tell us, you know. Oh my gosh, there's actually a lot to this. Cause it's not gonna tell us like, oh here is the whatever statue or you know whatever, you know, type of art. Queen's painting, April twenty fourth, twenty twenty, donated by Avery. The milkmaid, Jonas Vermeer, circa sixteen fifty eight, oil on canvas. This piece earned Vermeer the nickname Master of Light thanks to its exquisite contrast and depth. Vermeer painted this masterpiece at only 25, 25 of age. Many note that it is surprisingly small in real life. Can't like zoom in on it, just look at it. So, cool. Let's uh, sell all the other stuff and let me move some bells over here. But yeah, let me move. Oh, uh, we also gotta find the villager who lost their item. Let's do that and then sell. And then that should probably be it for this video. So, yeah. Got some, some new artwork, or a new exhibit in the museum, so really proud about that. Now uh, rest easy, blathers. All right, who lost this item? How many times am I gonna bump into you today? Hang on. Am I being pranked? Is there a hidden camera? You lose this? Hmm? You find something? I wish they would just say, no, I didn't lose anything. Doesn't look like mine, but you know who I bet that belongs to? Go talk to Vivian. How did Vivian end up on the clip? Okay, whatever. Any news, by the way? No, okay. Yeah, so there's the shop remodel back on April 19th. All right, Vivian, where are you at? Where did you run off to? She was just over here not that long ago. Oh, there she is. How are you, how are you today, Pyful? You dropped this? May I see it? Oh, how wonderful, my purse. I've been looking everywhere for this. That's a purse? What? Thank you so much. After all that, you let me, sh you let me show my appreciation, won't you? Here, take this. It's just a business suit coat, but I do want you to- Oh! Oh, that's actually- Yes. Yes, I would gladly take that. Cool. I'm definitely gonna put that in storage. Let me move... Okay, let me move this up here. Cool. Um... Yes. So with all that being said, let's go sell some stuff and see how much bills we get. Let's also see what's in the shop, too, for today. <sighs> kind of hoping it's a TV. That'd be nice to have. Oh, it's a piano. Even better. Hello, hello. Welcome to Nook's Cranny. And I need a microwave, too. Avery, welcome. Welcome. What do you need today? I want to sell. Now, we have a policy in place of not buying terms on Sundays. I'm sure you understand. We also need to find Daisy May. She's around here somewhere. I totally forgot to say Sunday. No, four lamp. I... Bought that. Alright. Ooh, yes. I'll gladly take it. Oh, really? You guys were selling a floor lamp, too? I'll pass since I bought one from Red. And then... Yes, this is... Yeah, these, this looks beautiful. I'll take it. Now let's see how much this piano is. Upright piano. Oh my gosh, I'll pass. I'll pass for right now. 
because that's that's a lot of bells. Holy cow! Seems like you're interested in a microwave. Yeah, let's buy it because I do plan on making the kitchen. Seems like you're interested in record box. Uh, yeah, why not buy it? All right, cool. We let's go find Daisy May. I totally forgot today was Sunday, so she should be around here somewhere on the island. <laughs> 